Um, I'm bringing you a vlog, a video from Milan in Italy for the International Yarn Bombing Festival. Um, oh, I'm so happy to be here. I've been involved with the organisation um, three times now. I've contributed three pieces over the years. Um, it was cancelled in Covid times, so um, I think I contributed a piece in 2019. Then 2020 I was due to come to Italy but it was cancelled due to Covid. 2021 I contributed a piece but I didn't come and now 2022 I've contributed another piece and I'm here. It's in Milan. Um, the organisation, uh, the people who organise it don't live here but they've um, used Milan as their base for the last couple of years and they are planning to go back to Trevento which is more south in Italy um, for next year but here I am and I have seen my pieces, uh, one from last year that they're hanging again and my new piece for this year I have seen it hanging um, in the streets and oh, it's wonderful. The sun is shining, it's really really warm uh, and the art on display is incredible. Um, so much love, so much uh, joy and time and passion in all these pieces. Um, nearly all crocheted, not much knitting, um, which is great. I love crochet. I love knitting too, don't get me wrong, but um, I'm coastal crochet and I haven't knitted for a long time uh, because knit crochet is my passion. Um, and it's really lovely to see so many pieces crocheted. And if you think of all the hours of crochet that has happened to bring these pieces here to Milan, it is incredible. And um, so here you go, uh, my video diary, my postcard to you from the International Yarn Bombing Festival in Milan. Enjoy. And here I am with my yarn bomb. Absolutely glorious to finally see it in Milan <laughs> with my name plaque too. Happy moment. So we've just had a bit of lunch. It's quite quiet at the moment. Uh, I think it's siesta or in Italy, I think they call it reposo, possibly. Um, but let me just take you through here while it's quiet some of the yarn bombs so behind me here is a piece called memory which has 
hundreds of poppies. It's incredible. And then over here is one of my favourite pieces, which is the camper van. Let's have a look. Here we go. Amazing. There we go. And then another favourite one of mine is the jungle framing, which is which has a sloth and a toucan and spider and actually it reminds me of my son's recent trip to Costa Rica. Um, he saw a lot of those animals. So here we go. One of my favourites. There you go. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic. So much fun. <laughs> Isn't it brilliant? I love it. <laughs> and then over this way, the shade is really lovely. There is another frame, and this time with really cool, fun, magical creatures. And then there's some pieces here. Some of the pieces were still from last year. Obviously the hours of work that have gone into some of these pieces is so amazing. And not all the artists have contributed again this year for various reasons. So they've got the pieces out from last year. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. <laughs> so there you go the International Yarn Bombing Festival. It's an absolute joy to be here. The man, it's not good for a phone. You. Okay, grazie. Ciao. Look at this one. That's amazing. And then there's one over here, which is really fascinating. Do you see the face in this one? This is knitted. The only knitted one I've seen so far. All the rest is crochet. But if you look at it front on, it's just lines. So you can see the face because I've shown you already. Maybe if I'd shown you this first and then shown you the face. When you look at it with the bare eye, it just shows lines. But when you go this way, the face very clearly comes into, into view. That's incredible, amazing.
so there you go I hope you enjoyed that little snapshot of the beautiful amazing crochet artworks on display here in Milan I'm hoping to take part again next year um, like I said earlier they are planning to bring the festival back to Trevento where it originated um, one of the organizers lives in Trevento uh, more in southern Italy more rural I might get there I'll certainly contribute to peace um, will I get there we shall see I'm just very very happy to have got to Milan to the festival this year um, and as always to share that with you because all this amazing crochet art oh yes it's great to do it on our own and share it with friends and family but when you can share it with even more people and spread that love and joy that's a good thing so um, take care everybody and uh, see you soon <laughs>